right, coming up next, it's a UFC heavyweight showdown. With the great Bruce Lee. No, if you're fighting Bruce Lee, you're shooting for takedowns right yeah. away. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. More than a decade separates these two fighters when it comes to the age, with big differences in height and reach. All right, now for the official introductions, we go inside the octagon to Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City. <laughs> Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet six inches tall, weighing in at 211 pounds. Fighting out of Baldurgorsk, Ukraine, prime time. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, USA, Bruce the Dragon Lee. All right, make the rules in the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. I want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, go back to your corners, come out fighting. The fighters touch gloves. You ready? You ready? So, well, the tension is palpable as this fight gets underway, and it's going to be interesting to see how this matchup plays out. Definite striker on one side against another guy who can really do it. All. And in those situations, normally the guy that's more well-rounded will be the one that will find success. I want to see how this plays out. Big head kick lands. I mean, can you imagine having a reach advantage like this? What a luxury! It's a luxury. I've never had one over the course of my entire career. But fighting guys that are taller, you struggle whenever they are very aware of such a massive advantage. This guy is going to try and use this tonight. Effective strike there by Lee. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Oh, nice job by him there to slip that off him. Now going upstairs with the left hook. Let's get some Let's get going. Beautiful body kick land right under the elbow. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Oh, tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Lee. Timely defense there. Huge block for him. Oh, just out of range with that punch attempt. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Trying to go to the body here, unable to find the target. Big ball punch land. Now he gets back to range. Leg kick. Just over three minutes to go, round one. Good job keeping that head off the center line. Slips to avoid the right hand. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Oh, beautiful kick to the body there, and he just left himself wide open for that strike. Very vulnerable by leaning in, keeping the guard high to allow for an opening down low. Nice punch land over the top. Mixes it up nicely. That one appeared to stun him. Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. And 
once again looking for that highlight reel KO with that front kick. Just out of range with that left hook. Very tricky. Hardy closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. Single collar tie now. Well, you see him land the jab there. He's got the reach advantage. You might as well use it. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. Good night if that landed. That was a nice play. Lee's kick to the body is blocked. Nice job of hiding that head kick. Connects now with the one two. through the replay. He got the knockdown. He won the round. He did everything correct. The only thing he didn't do is finish the fight. But if he continues down the path, if he continues to do the exact same thing as he did before, he will get that finish. Here, another strike lands there. Let's get going now. Big kick lands. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. I mean, he's cutting them down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Nice body kick. And that left hook landed on the button. Well, it's one thing to have length, it's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Lee. Oh, he's been working hard defensively, quick block there. Well, he has landed some good shots, DC, but really unable to string anything together in terms of solid combinations. It's because he's not committing to it fully. He throws his jab. He may flow the right hand out there, but he's not really sitting down with the right hand. He really doesn't seem to have the intent on landing it. He's got to be confident that it's going to land, and he's got to really throw his whole entire body into those strikes. Oh, really using his reach advantage there as he lands the punch, DC. Lee gets hit with a kick. That one appeared to land flush. All right, single collar tie now. Real sneaky body kick. Just over three minutes to go now. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. 
Nice punch there. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Let's go. Push forward. Oh, and there's a land with the kick, so certainly a good sign for him there. When that's working, you no know he's in for a good night. All right, so a knockdown for him in the previous round, and you can just see by his body language how confident he is in the striking realm in this matchup. And you can see his confidence in his posture, but also you can see the effect the knockdown had on his by the way he is approaching this round. So a much different approach from him here in round two. Took him a while to find the range, get in his striking rhythm. He has found it here, and as a result, has really picked up the pace in round two. Good stick. Single collar tie there. Well placed kick there by Lee. There's no give on that leg kick. Another powerful kick there. A lot of volume with the feet tonight for him. It's unbelievable to watch somebody make kicking the base of their fighting style. He has shown us that it's possible. Ooh, what a punch. Chris boxing here, the right punch followed immediately up by a left. They continue to exchange. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. And he landed the right hand there. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Well done to catch the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. Oh, that's a nice strike. Oh, huge Superman punch. over gut check time for him now you see the cut on his cheek has gotten really really bad and even though it's not affecting his vision if it gets any worse the doctor will be called in and i can assure you he's going to have no choice but to stop this fight all right there's the end of the round and you've got to be in a serious flow to not just execute that superman punch but to even attempt it to even try it you got to be really in your rhythm everything has to be going perfectly as we saw in the lead up to that attack you ready well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. Oh, just open it up on him now. There's no tell on that leg. Oh, he's got it going tonight. Beautiful combination of strikes there by Lee. Real sneaky head kick gets in there. Ooh, what a punch. Nice head kick. Another 
first strike to the body. It looked like it did stun him a little bit. Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go take that finish down. Oh! Though. The jab followed by the right hand. Good series of strikes by him there. Great job of mixing it up, staying active. Keep it busy, Whoa. doing great. He mercifully stopped the fight. A great stoppage and a great performance by this young man. Come on, let's take a look back at the replay. It ends up a knockout, but this was really a striking clinic from the moment they touched him. I mean, a competitive fight that one guy finally found the shot that ended the fight. But both of these warriors displayed a ton of heart. One guy got the finish, but neither guy should be disappointed in their performance. And we go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer has your official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Bergliano is going to stop to this contest at two minutes, 12 seconds of round number three. Playing the winner by knockout, Bruce the Dragon. Well, we congratulate him on a huge knockout here tonight. He'll probably keep that smile while he's sleeping tonight after what he was able to produce here. He's going to be smiling for a really long time. When you get a knockout like that, not only do you get the win, you also most times walk away with a $50,000 bonus check.